Hi Cabo everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how I get ready for date night. First we're going to start off with the makeup. First I take my Premier Dead Sea Age Defying Moisturizer and I wipe that all over my face. Then I take my eyebrow brush and brush up my eyebrows. Then I grab my MAC Fix Plus Spray and wet my brush. And then I dip that wet brush in the darkest shade in my CoverGirl Coffee Shop eyeshadow kit. And I use that to fill in my eyebrows and I get them all nice and filled in. Then I use my eyebrow brush to brush out any harsh lines. Then I'll take my Cover Effects Contour Kit in color three and I use that to conceal around my eyebrows and get those eyebrows all fully. <laughs> yes, and I brush out the concealer with my Real Techniques brush. Then I use my <laughs> fingers to apply more concealer to my eyelids to act as a base for my eyeshadow and my eyeshadow primer. And the eyeshadow primer I'm going to be using is Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. It helps with the creasing. Then I go back in with that CoverGirl eyeshadow kit and coffee shop and I grab the darkest shade and put that in the corners of my eyes. And then I'll take a blending brush to blend it all out. It acts as my transition shade for the smoky eye. After that, I grab my Stila Impressionist palette. I take the black shade and I use that in the corner of my eyes also and just blend it in with the black to really create that smoky eye look. And for the corners of my eyes, I'm going to be using the Fenty Beauty Kilowatt Highlighter in Hustler Baby. Yes, yes! Hustler Baby, that's one of my faves. And I just use that in the corners. And I use that in the corner of my eyes to get my Oju to be sorry. You know, that's Yoruba for your eyes that are talking. So yes, Oju to Sorrow. And I just blend all of that together. And then I add more. And then I blend more. I go back in with my CoverGirl eyeshadow kit and grab the copper shade. And use that to really create a gradient to just blend all those colors together. Of course, I add a little bit to the corners so that my eyes can pop off even more. Yes. Up next is the primer. So I'm going to use the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Instant Retouch Primer. Wow, that was a mouthful. And I'm just going to rub that ever so gently into my face to create a nice flawless layer for my foundation. Before I apply my foundation, I'm going to use another primer, which is the Dr. Brandt Pores No More Pore Refiner Primer to really make my pores look smaller. I do have a little bit of textured skin and enlarged pores from previous acne. So I just dab that in to my pores so I can get that real flawless finish. Then I grab my LA Girl Pro Concealer Orange Corrector to correct all the dark spots and the rings on my nose. That one dark spot on my forehead that will not let me be great and I dab it in. Watch me dab, yes. Dab, dab, dab. All right, next I go in with my Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Foundation in the color 400 and 420. They didn't have my color, so I created a blending concoction. That's why I'm putting all this on my face. It's two different shades. Then I take my Fenty Beauty foundation brush and work that foundation in. I love my Fenty Beauty foundation. However, you are going to work for that finish. You really have to work hard to blend it in. So I'm blending it in and then blending it in some more and blending it in even more. Yep, blend, blend, blend. And then I add another layer of the Fenty Beauty just so that my face can be flawless. Okay, we're going on a date. We need to be looking, looking juicy. 
Next, I go in with my favorite product, which is the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in the color NC45. That all under my eyes, the chin on my cupid's bow. And I use my Real Techniques brush, concealer brush, to blend that out. I prefer brushes when it comes to using this concealer. And I just blend it out and blend it out until my little heart is content and until that concealer is blunt. Okay? <laughs> just rhymed. And yeah, blend and blend it, blend and blend, blend, blend. my Fenty Beauty sponge to blend even more. Then I go back in with my cover effects. I get the lightest shade and put that underneath my eyes to make my under eyes pop off even more. Then I take my brush and put the concealer down the bridge of my nose and on my cupid's bow. Then I will take my Fenty Beauty matte stick in the color Espresso to contour my nose. Then I take a small brush and brush out the contour outwards. That's just the way that I like to contour. I like to brush it out with a small brush. And when I'm done doing that, I go in with a buffing brush and I buff out that contour so the lines aren't so harsh. So I don't look like I'm painting my nose. So it's making sense. Everything's making sense. And I blend it even more with a blending sponge and blend again. You know, your contour needs to be making sense, okay? And then I take my MAC Studio Fix Powder and I use that to set my under eyes because that is a couple shades lighter than me. It's NC43. And I take my matchstick again in Espresso to contour on my cheeks. Yeah, that's me feeling myself. And then I blend it out with my foundation brush. That all blended, I'll take my matchstick in the color suede to highlight that contour even more. Get a real chiseled and defined look. I take my blotting powder. I use concealer to highlight my cupid's bow. And blend some more. You can never blend too much, let me tell you. Then I take the lightest shade in my contour kit to highlight underneath my eyebrows. Next, I'm gonna go in with my NYX matte liquid liner and line out my eyes and create that wing look I'm gonna go in with my IT Cosmetics Mascara Superhero. I'm going to brush on the top of my eyelids, then the bottom. Then I'll take my Ardell Faux Mink and my Duo Lash Adhesive and apply my lashes. And once I'm done applying, sometimes I like to go in with my eyeliner. Oh, get me feeling myself. Ah! And then I'll go in with my Clean Colors Lip Pencil in the color Never. It's one of my favorite colors. One of my favorite lip pencils. Only $1 at your local beauty supply. And I go in with my NYX Liquid Suede Matte Lipstick to act as a base for my NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the color Transylvania. It's kind of creamy, so I put that on to matte it a little more. Then I take my blotting powder and put it on top of that lipstick to 
mattify it. I'm gonna take my Fenty Beauty highlighter in Hustler Baby and rub that all over my cheek. For my blush, I'm using Tarte Parte with three A's. <laughs> and after that, I'm gonna add a little bit of highlighter to the bridge of my nose and blend it out. And conceal around my lips to really make that lipstick crisp. And to finish up the look, I take the lighter shade in my contour kit and put some more under my eye because I love me some concealer. Done with this look, onto the hair. So next step is the hair. First I start off by flat ironing my edges. Like I have this thing where I need my edges to be making sense. It's important that our edges are smooth. So then I take my Eco Styler Gel and I take a toothbrush and just smooth out those edges even more. Normally I tie it down with a scarf, but today time did not permit. And I'm just gonna go right into just flat ironing my bangs and making them somewhat presentable. I didn't really have time to straighten my hair that much. Then I'm gonna go in with my metallic gold bobby pins. I love these bobby pins. I got them from Forever 21. I'm going for the modern glam look. And I just put all my bobby pins in. Straighten my hair, comb out my hair. Straighten my hair, T-wash, trying to get in the video. I'm not making it super straight, but I'm making it presentable. But straight enough to make sense, you get me. And that is the finished hair look. Now it's time for the outfit. With this outfit, I was trying to channel modern glam, like I said before. I got the fur, the shirt, and the trousers. I got them all from Zara. And the gold necklaces are gifts from my mother. And that is the final look. I hope you guys liked the video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, I love you guys. Tony, get out. Today I'm helping. No, Tony, I will beat this girl. She's doing my guy, by you. Take. Like it. I'm not drinking it with that. Jump up, Jari. <laughs>